And when he was walking on the water, he was focused on Jesus and he was going to Jesus and, and he was able to overcome the physics of this water and his body weight. He was able to cross this water. Something miraculous has taken place and, and it was a marvelous thing that's happened because we understand from the scripture that the water and the wind was contrary to them. The water that you have to go through in life is so you can get up and walk on it. It's not so that you can drown or, or that God is done and God is going to destroy you and that you're, you're going to die. No, no. You have to see things from a different paradigm. You have to understand that God is involved in something in your life and what He started in your life, He's going to finish that in your life until the day of Jesus Christ. He may take you through a few things. You may have to go through some valleys. You may have to go over some hills. But God is not done yet. God is about to do something in your life.